With spring here, California is very close to being clear of drought conditions. These past few weeks were filled with some intense historic rainfall and snow. Some residents in the more vulnerable weather communities nearby were having a difficult time due to the extreme conditions. The only door I could open and stand out on was my front door on just the landing, about a foot out doors. I had to hire the kids next door for days to shovel. Our mountain neighbors in Lake Arrowhead had way more to worry about than just the snow. My sewer line either froze lower down. Things were backing up. I couldn't flush my toilets. I couldn't take a shower. Take a shower. They said, don't run. Take as, you know, do as little as water as you possibly can. The snow levels were so high that you could only imagine what the roadways were like. If you look at the level of snow, this is after about a week of snow melted. You can only imagine what it was like when it was fresh snow. Just about 50 miles away is the popular Mountain High Resort. We got over 11 feet of snow and we ended up having to close down for 10 days. Um, as you can see in the background how high the snow was piled up, it was piled up across the entire parking lot like that. And so they had plows working every day, people were out here shoveling. And uh, I live in Wrightwood, which is only five miles down the road. The first two days I couldn't really get out. Uh, the snow was piled up probably uh, to my mid waist. Governor Gavin Newsom proclaimed a state of emergency in multiple counties due to the storms. And with a surge of warmer storms coming our way, officials and communities are worried about what is to come next. Now it's the flood and the rain. With the support from officials and the community throughout the scary conditions, everyone is hoping for the safety of all. This is Canyons News. I'm Natalie Dodds.